I want to know about the first time you and Petey first met. When you first oh, met. absolutely. The I want to hear from your side. To be honest. So what it occurred was, is I was on the independence at the time. I had to hide the fact that I was wildly affluent because I didn't want to get heat from the boys. Okay, I wasn't in a position of power yet where I could openly talk about my background. So I was working for that fat jalop Tommy Dreamer at the time for a promotion called House of Hardcore. <laughs> and Tommy uh, points his fat gelatinous fingers at me and he asks me if I can pick up Petey Williams from the airport. Now, it took me a couple hours to remember who Petey Williams was. And then I remembered it was Scott Steiner's sidekick after, you know, going through the memory <laughs> So I hopped in my car, I picked this guy up, he gets in my car, and I got to tell you guys, it's the saddest thing. <sighs> he was so rude. I mean, he was oh. so devastatingly rude. He was telling, he was telling me, he was telling me I was driving too fast, then he was telling me I was driving too slow, then he's telling me he wasn't comfortable in the car. Then he kept on going on and on about how over he was in TNA. <laughs> and it was just nonstop him putting himself over. For what felt like five hours on a 30-minute drive. Um, <laughs> I still have flashbacks. Sometimes I wake up in a motel room with one of my Rizzes in a cold sweat. And they're like, Max, what's wrong? What's wrong? And I say, oh, God, I just remember the time I had to drive Petey Williams to a House of Hardcore show. It was traumatic. <laughs> yep, got, that's, uh, that's pretty much exactly how it went. It's uh, how it went down. All right. He's not even denying. <laughs> um, pretty, pretty close. Pretty close. Yeah. Uh, so, so, Petey, how I did got it? Uh, what's that? So, 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 your perspective. Let, what's your perspective? <laughs> oh, you know, Go ahead, I, Pete, uh, lie to the public. Oh man. Uh, <laughs> geez. Um, <laughs> my perspective. Well. I don't, I don't know if I want to answer that. 